the link to go to this portal is www uh, this www.idm.gov.in once you click on this, this link then this portal appears now what are the steps to enroll for dsc uh, is given in this uh, presentation there are two sets of configuration need to be done one is java configuration and another is microsoft edge configuration for java configuration you need to download the latest version of java as this java version is already downloaded in my pc uh, i am not going to show you how to download java but the same can be done through uh, using google and you can download java through google and another is microsoft edge configuration uh, i can give you the uh, that microsoft edge configuration is also microsoft edge is also available on google or any other search engine you can download from there and the configuration can be given here demo but the downloading part and the installing part is understood that it is very well understood and not need to be repeated again so how to do the so i am uh, you can see that you can download java by following this link and once the java is downloaded in your system you need to run it and you to install it once it is installed then you need to go for configure java in your uh, this if you are following the windows system then you need to uh, go for this uh, search and type configure java and you need to click on configure java now this java control panel is coming that is visible okay okay so in security you need to go in security and in security you can find the exception site list as you can see the exception site in site list already this portal is uh, this site is given i am going to edit this site list for the sake of demo i am going to remove it again i am going to remove it and i am going to again add this just this is for the sake of demo because already the site has been added just for the demo purposes i have removed it there is no need to again remove it if you have already added so what i have done is that i have gone to the exception site list i have uh, copy pasted the link and i have added now you can see that link is appearing you have to again go to the uh, add button and add this second link also so there will be no ambiguity or no issue will come out so you can see now the two side is, is done java configuration is, configuration is done we have to go for the configuration of microsoft edge now microsoft edge is freely available on internet you need to down uh, anyone who is desires to having dsc uh, sign enrollment in the idm portal need to download this microsoft edge if the microsoft uh, uh, microsoft edge so i am going to give you the a uh, demo of my uh, this edge config configuration i hope this browser is visible to everyone please confirm me please please yes, sir okay okay thank you uh, now you can see a pop up has appear on this three dots uh, i have clicked on three dots uh so you can see you need to go to settings in settings you need to type inter internet explorer explorer in the internet explorer internet explorer you will find there is a provision for internet explorer mode i mode button so in my case it is already on what happens generally it is not already on so you need to go in the site uh, you need to go in settings and you need to switch on this button so this will allow internet microsoft edge to be downloaded in, uh, to be uh, work in internet explorer mode so once this is done for the dsc enrollment you need to type in the website www.idm.gov.in
the site will appear now after the site will appear you need to go to uh, these three dots again in these three dots you will find that there is a reload in internet explorer mode button is coming again so you need to click on this reload in internet mode so what will happen this site will again load in i explorer, i explorer mode and this will also give you prompt here so you can see now it is saying that you are in internet explorer mode most pages work better in microsoft edge so you need to work in internet explorer mode only i am going to use a dummy uh, login credentials that i have created for a demo purposes So, uh, for enrollment of DSC, you need to go to enroll DSC. So you can you can see that my DSC has already been enrolled. I am going to remove it. There is a facility that you can also remove the enrolled DSC, and I am going to again uh, enroll the DSC again for the demo. So now the DSC enrolled data is removed. So you can see that my DSC data is already removed. For those who are not uh, well versed that how to do this enrollment, we have also uploaded. Uh, we have also uploaded uh, that manual here also how to enroll DSC. Now I am going to give you the steps of how to enroll DSC. You need to go to enroll DSC, and then this application will appear. do you want to run this application digital store you need to accept it once you will accept it you need to press on run after that run will be done you will find that there is a enrollment button is appearing on this enrollment button will appear it means that your java configuration has been done properly and you are working in ie mode in case this enrollment button is not appearing and only white box is appearing it means there are either the problem with the java configuration or either the problem is that you are working in a different uh, ie mode so once this enrollment will come you need to press on enrollment so it will ask for the signature so ask for the pin and once you do this it will give you this prompt digital signature certificate has been successfully enrolled and you will see that now it is appearing as you can see that i have successfully enrolled the dsc so it is appearing here so this is the uh, this is the demonstration for the